all the things I left behind. But now I know we can't change the past. We're too young to know the reason why. And it all comes rushing back, rushing back. And it all comes rushing back, rushing back. And it all comes rushing back, rushing back. And it all comes rushing back. I feel the gravity pulling me faster than it. Hi everybody, welcome to you to the London Stadium, the home of the 2012 Olympics. Martin Tyler here, Alan Smith is alongside me. Premier League football is coming right up for you. It's West Ham United against Arsenal. I love visiting this ground, rarely been disappointed with the entertainment on offer. Don't think I will be today either. West Ham United's lineup is this. Lucas Fabianski plays in goal. Issa Diop plays with Eric Bailly at the back. They've got plenty of goal threat with two strikers in the attack. This is the Arsenal lineup. Bent Leno starts in goal. Lucas Klosterman plays with Alexander Kolarov as the fullbacks. And the main striker is Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Well, West Ham United took over Enjoy the, the London Stadium at the start of the 2016-17 season. Quite a bit of an adjustment for them from their previous ground, but helped turn this multi-sport arena into a stadium fit for football. Yeah, and I think the great thing about it is it holds so many people. And I think we'll see some fantastic atmospheres inside this ground in the next few years. Bowen. Went in quickly there. That'll be a throw. Antonio. He's got the ball back for his team with that tackle. Well, you don't win anything, Alan, do you, for being top at this stage of the season? But it's uh, quite a, an experience to enjoy, particularly for the fans when the league table is published. And they will go top if they win. Lovely, incisive pass. Well, they're happy, the back line, because the flag has come to their rescue, really. Yeah, it was good uh, organisation between those defenders. Nice straight line. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. And it's a shot now! It's gone to the goalkeeper in very soft fashion. And the attacker cannot believe that he's messed this one up. Simple for the keeper. Yeah, he can't believe his luck, can he, the keeper? Little boy smile. He knows that that should have been a goal. And Hammers unable to hold on to the ball. A couple of really good game that we might be focusing on. Well, I think both of these players should come into this match with their cop. Threads it through. All Peters out rather for them. Read the play well to intercept. West Ham United. More than useful at the moment, and they're hoping to get another victory here. They played very well last time out in that away victory against Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, 5-0, how about that? Come back down to earth today, perhaps, with a draw. Squandering possession cheaply, really, with that pass. Oh, he's totally, totally done the defender. 
He's won it back easily. Noble. Mikel Antonio. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. Keeping the ball is one thing, but they've got to try and open up the opposition. Saw the goal and went for it. Keeper's done very well here. Well, listen to the noise here. These fans haven't had too much to cheer of late in this match, but this could be a moment for them. Well, that's good defending. Noble. Teammates getting out of the way because they know he can dribble it here. Here's the chance. And a goal. And they've opened the scoring now. He was the calmest man in the stadium there to place it to the keeper's right. West Ham are in the lead. Good interception there. Mesut Ozil. Well, now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? Felipe and really in the clear now, in on goal. And that will end the threat, at least for the moment. Mesut Ozil. Throw to come up now, after the ball's gone out. And they've spread it out wide here. He's got the ball there in the defensive zone by reading the play very well. It's good play to get a foot in and intercept. Good purpose in the tackle. Pepe. Well, look at the room in which to attack. I think the cross the is on. Is Two more minutes to be played then, added time. Added time. Don't like him really to play the ball straight to the opposition. Slip past his man now. Good work really to read the in. And that's half time. Signaled by the referee. 1 0 the half time score. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Yeah, it's a good first 45 minutes from the lad. Got the ball rolling with that goal, and he's been central to most of the good things his team has done. So the referee's happy, and the second half gets underway. Room now out of the wing. Could whip it in from here. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Read the play well. Coming up for you on EA Sports, don't forget, don't miss this, the coverage of the Premier League fixture, West Ham United, they'll be facing Southampton away from home. Yeah, far too close, the cross to the keeper. Oh, it could be dangerous. Shots up! Push back out into play. Can they turn it in despite the goalkeeper's save? Real promise about that build-up until that challenge. Mesut Ozil. Cross to man. He might have put his teammate in here. The target, Aubameyang. That's out of danger there with that clearance. They're looking to get to him and take the ball from him. Mesut Ozil. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross.
Bowen. Deal. That's an unforced error, really, with the pass. Felipe Anderson. Felipe Anderson. Chance to get forward from the wing. Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. Cleared away by the defender. Got the ball, and they're going at the opposition with speed. Working the opposition over a little bit here with their passing. Arsenal give it away. Antonio. He could take them on here. Chance to cross it. Needs to be quick. Throw in here. Arsenal with the substitution. Antonio. Very good tackle. I was with the officials before the game, Alan, and they were consulting their devices to get weather forecasts in, and they're hopeful. They knew there would be some snow, but they're still hopeful. They want to get the game played, of course. Well, of course they do. Once they're here, once we're all here, we want to get it played to a conclusion, but if it does get any worse, who knows? Pepe. Lucas Klosterman. Albama Yang. And the tackler has been very successful there. He's got possession. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Set up to play on the break now. Obama Young! And five minutes remaining. Still 1 0 here, with the time almost up. What about this uh, impacting on the next game? Well, West Ham United go up against Southampton after this and. Uh, and they've certainly done the job out here, and I'd be confident to doing it again in the next one. They're trying to slip it through. And it's a goal here. And they are really bossing the game now. It's all about the weight of the pass here. He hardly had to break stride, and he finished it emphatically. Restarting at 2-0. There's only a minute to go. Number 13, Mikhail Antonio. It's finished here. Well, you wondered how these teams were going to be separated, but they've managed to do that and come out on the right end of the result here. Yeah, it was a tight old affair. Difficult to call for most of this game. Just a couple of questions for you. Thanks very much.
Well, you recognise him, I know, but he's definitely on view today. The top scorer in the league, and it's live. Hi there, everyone. Welcome to Southampton, to St Mary's Stadium. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is with me up on the television platform here. Premier League football for you, very shortly. It's Southampton against West Ham United. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Looking forward to this. I'm hoping for a nice, quick start. It will set the standard here between two good teams. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Antonio. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Looking for teammates in the middle. Oh, they open the scoring here. It's a good start. It's a flying start, really. They have scored a really good goal. Well, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. West Ham are in the lead. It's Ward Prowse. It's good play, this. The opposition can't get at them when they're keeping the ball. Stopping the pass, getting through with a good piece of anticipation. At Chelsea, there's a penalty, Alan McAnally. It's a penalty for Bournemouth. He's put the ball down on the spot. Finish score. Here he comes. Oh, straight down the middle. Beautiful, beautiful penalty. 11 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. With great vision here. And they blocked it then. James Ward Prowse. Saw the pass and dealt with it. Rice. Antonio. Golden opportunity now. Well taken goal. And a good possession for them now. Now they're two in front. And there was a gap to the keeper's left, and he found that with real power. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Well, you could see what he was trying to do, but he couldn't execute it at all. Well, there's been a goal in the Liverpool game. Alan McAnally. It's a goal. Alan! Very nearly a goal. It's hit the bar, and it's back in play. Hit it well, just needed a bit more luck with that effort. Halle. Once takes the shot on. He's done well to block that. He's won it back easily.
Is he in here? Brilliant defending. He was almost. Noble. Issa Diop. He's had a go here. In goal, Alex McCarthy. That's uh, an easy save for him. Yes, it was a goal for Liverpool, just to confirm that for you. The news from Alan McAnally. The score is now 1-0. West Ham controlling possession so far. Guided through. Antonio. Real chance. Real chance. It's another one for them. They go further in front and they are full value for this position. For West Ham, the winning margin they will feel. It would be a big mistake if they let it slip from here. Surely not. I think they're there. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair. But look at the scoreline. Now, can they make this count? Keeping the ball well. Tries to shot here. The keeper can deal with that. Oriol Romeo. It's Ward Prowse. There's a deflection, it's a corner. James Ward Prowse with the corner. The goalkeeper comes out with a punch. Well, here he goes. That's great work by the goalkeeper. Corner played in. Any danger to the goal has gone with that clearance. Maybe the cross. Has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes of any time. He's missed the target by quite a lot in the end. And that's the referee signalling for half time, blowing his whistle. And it's Well, we wait to see what the second half brings. The first half was conclusive, but you don't win the game at half-time. Rice. Sebastian Haller. Something happening at Chelsea that we need to know about. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Chelsea. 51 minutes played. 1 1. Oh, interesting news again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. Well, a real treat in store for you. Coverage on EA Sports of the Premier League fixture for Southampton. They'll be facing Aston Villa away from home. Guiding it through the defenders. Wonderful save. Here comes the corner. Fantastic save. And there was danger, but he's cleared it. Now it's a free kick that the referee has decided to award. What do you think about West Ham's next game? Yeah, they're playing Newcastle United in their next match in the quarter final. And judging on the form so far, I can't see. Good vision. Had to be very quick, the keeper there, to get the ball. We've had an hour gone here, and still 30 minutes left. Saw that coming, and intercepted. Oh, he's through. Oh, it's the post! Trying to get away, on the break. But that move was quickly broken up itself. Great touch on the ball. He's blocked that well. Top news from Anfield, Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Liverpool. 64 minutes played, 3-0. Thanks, Alan. Well, we'll follow that with interest. Fredericks. Could be a cross here. It could be dangerous. Good defensive clearance there.
It'll be a throw. And the manager, Alan, is making this change here. Substitution will take place. Well, he's done his bit. He got the goal that put his team in the lead. Can they hold that lead? Now Felipe Anderson. Striding forward, purposefully. They've gone wide. Chance to get the ball in the box. Fredericks. Aim for those in the middle. Only partially cleared, so... Antonio! Well, that needed a more subtle touch. He's gone for power, and he's nowhere near. Well, I don't think he kept his head down, actually. Probably thought he'd scored before he'd even hit it. Well, we could get some news on the injury. I think Jeff Shreves is on the case. From down here, it looks as though he landed actually on top of his elbow. That's why he's in so much discomfort, and that's why, of course, the bench are so concerned. As always, Jeff does know what's going on, and thanks for that, Jeff. It's good attacking play, this, from them. He might be through. Very brave goalkeeping coming out like this. Starting position was right, and he had a lovely turn of pace to narrow down the angle there. Fredericks. Now Andrei Yamalenko. Socek. Yamalenko. Well, he has got a chance to get the cross in. The ball glued to his boots, it seems. Excellent work. He's missed the target by some distance in the end. Well, there are other options from the bench. Still seven minutes left on the clock. So not much time left at all. What does this mean, Alan, for their next game? Well, Southampton go up against Aston Villa, Martin, and... Uh... And I think there'll be a few words spoken in the dressing room afterwards because they've been miserable out there. Well defended, not just getting across, he thought quickly as well. Wasteful pass, unforced error really. Guiding it through the defenders. Shot off! He's almost defied gravity to get to that one. Full stretch, it was headed for the corner that one. In goes the corner. Not really away from the threat here. He hasn't quite got it as he wanted, Alan, has he? No. Next time, maybe he'll take a touch. Rice. Referee's pointed for a free kick here. Time for a few quick questions. Thanks, that's all the... They don't want me to know about my heritage Out here doing what they never did Sleep is a cause of the death It's probably why I got so many relatives Landing in Brazil when I fill up From the Sudan to jail but a sinner They said my dreams would have never get bigger The face of an angel but the mind of it Yo, I'm got, I'm got, if I ever get provoked Lying in the devil's block, you're regretting what you sold Blessings are the woes, it's the heaven where you go Let me know the price that you're selling for your soul When you're selling demons belling on your phone The concrete rolls, was it never gonna grow I sign my deal on one condition When it's my time, just let it know Nearly died 
tried the other day. Uh, More time, I feel like I just wanna run away. Yeah. Picture perfect now, I'm paying picture with clothes. Uh, Chain to your love, sugar coat it in gold. Uh, Granddad told me your shit gone so. Uh, bad man, which part bad man gone show? Uh, Where's my I need that? Pick up, pick up, then off to the now nah, I'm imprisoned by decision, should've listened to my granny Had a vision of bringing all my to the Grammys All my dying one by one yeah. Pray that my mommy don't find my uh, Hit my part for a reason yeah. Make some apple pies from the garden of Eden uh, yeah. Your maid calls nice and you saying for dessert yeah. Mom cried tears, my name in the hush yeah. Nothing's working, I've been tripping, no one's perfect, chasing vision, just a surface. Should I begin? Man upon a mission, still a martyr for the vision. Uh, had to find my voice when them people would they listen. Thank you for joining us. We'll start the questions now.
Stretch it, stretch it, make sure the money do. Stretch it, stretch it, make sure the money do. Stretch it, stretch it, make sure the money do. Stretch it, stretch it, stretch it, yo. My bro just came from Dubai, now he wants four. Man, I told him that's madness. Money with the world, do backflips. Make sure you keep all together, elastic. Stretch it, stretch it, make sure the money do backflips. This one must have came from. If I say it, then it's gonna be a long thing. A long way to go this season, but a colossal match between first and second today that could play a pivotal role in the title race. It's West Ham United, they face Liverpool, and it's coming up live on EA TV next. And a warm welcome from one of the newer venues here in the football mad capital of England. We're at the London Stadium. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former England defender Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's West Ham United taking on Liverpool. Yeah, thanks Derek. I'm just hoping we get a nice quick tempo from the start of this game. Both teams do like to get forward, both positive in their approach in the game. So we should be in for some entertainment. Sadio and a fine stop. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. The experienced Lukas Fabianski stands between the posts. Eric Bailly starts alongside Fabian Balbuena in central defence. And it's two strikers up front who'll look to provide the goal scoring threat. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. The highly rated Brazilian Alisson begins between the posts. Joel Matti plays alongside Virgil van Dijk in central defence. And leading opportunity here. Anderson! Goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. I cannot believe he's kept that out the net. Absolutely amazing. Now what can Liverpool do with this advantageous situation? He has time to play it over. Playing it in, keeping it low. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. Excellent vision. Just drifted into the illegal position. Offside, in the opinion of the officials. We can go to Alan McAnally now for news of a goal in the Wolves game. Alan. It's a goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. It's been scored by Val Moutinho. A corner was played short. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Antonio... Targets available, Cross comes in. And he's clear his lines. Couldn't keep it. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? Crossing possibilities. Decent cross, but nobody in the vicinity. Given away. Fabinho. It's there for him! He'll be cross with himself based on the position he had taken up. Well, yeah, it was poor technique, wasn't it? Thrashed at it a little bit, went for power. Well, that was the chance to take the lead, and the manager's frustration is there for all to see. Well, we did have to cut Allen and attempting the through ball. Oh, now, Allaire. And a goal it is, the opener in this game. Well, keep it tight. That's what both managers would have been saying. But now the opening goal's gone in. Tactics have got to change. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. And underway again, it's West Ham in front. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. 
Well, we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up. It's West Ham United facing Crystal Palace. Yeah, atmospheres make games, Derek, and that should be an absolute belter. I believe there's been a goal in the City game. Alan can fill us in. It's a goal for Manchester City. It's been scored by Raheem Sterling. He ran onto a lovely through ball, played between two defenders and slotted home comfortably. 33 minutes played, 1-1. Thank you, Alan McAnally. Henderson. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. And the Liverpool throw in forthcoming. Sadio Mane now. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. It is to be a throw-in. Useful ball towards the back post this time. And the conclusion, he's missed the opportunity. Suchek and the ball with Aller. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. He's enjoying space. So the whistle then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but. You could make a strong case for this man. Lee, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, I hope these defenders have read the player notes for this game. They're up against the goal machine. They need all their focus and attention. Away they go in the second half with Liverpool trailing currently. Wijnaldum. the ball Masuaku Felipe Anderson crossing opportunity it has to be and that a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again Felipe Anderson Noble oh, chance after chance the fans sense a goal just listen to this Derek and then Again, I don't want to look at it as a former defender. I've scored a few of these in my time, and they were always my fault, not playing for all of them. Important the players pick him up from here on in. Well, an own goal that has left them trailing and flailing. It's with Roberto Firmino. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Showing patience as well as persistence. It's got to be! Oh, he's given it. The referee says penalty. And an opportunity for them to pull one back here. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Liverpool taking on Leicester City. Yeah, atmospheres make games, Derek, and that should be an absolute belter. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Space afforded him. It needs an accurate cross. He cuts it back. Danger averted. Well, for more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. The feeling down here is he's twisted his knee. You can just see him testing it out every now and then. At the moment, though, he's carrying on. Cheers, Jeff.
Antonio. We can go to Adam. An incisive pass. Slipshod passing. Sincere apologies for having to cut you off just then, Alan. Just to confirm, Wolves did score in that match. And they are seemingly cruising now. 3-0 in front. That is a wonderful challenge, and they've kept the ball to boot. Counter-attacking very much an option. No ball. Antonio, and treading it forward. And he has just veered into an offside position this time. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Well, his first touch let him down, but still he has the ball. This is Salah. Keita. Good challenge by Eric Bailly. Could be a chance to break here. Antonio. Antonio. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. He has time to play it over. It's got to be! Virgil van Dijk with the block. Well, let's join Alan McAdally because a goal has been scored at the Etihad. It's a second goal for Manchester City. Nine minutes remain, 2-1. Alan McAnally with his finger on the pulse. Roberto Firmino. It's with Fabinho. Sadio Mane now. Sadio Mane's cross. It comes to nothing. And five minutes to go. And breaking at pace with Menace. Wonderfully weighted pass. It looked as though he might have been onside, but he was just a fraction off. Oh, I'm not so sure. I'd like to see that again. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. And then! Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. A brilliant display. Well, we can take another look at this now, and he's connected so well with it, generated a lot of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. Look. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. We have entered the final minutes of normal time. And the referee says that is all for today. Oh, hi there. I've just got a couple of questions about the match. Thanks. That's all the questions. Summer sun, a Ben and M can't figure if the summer's done. Pour another glass, it back, sip another with wine. Two checking in the color spine. Uh, cassette, fling it on the desk, number one. I'm trying to keep all the respect for my number cons, but never coming for your neck if I'm under fun.
Welcome everyone. Thanks very much. Let's start taking some questions, please. Okay. Thank you. 